You've been in Dallas for a while. You were there for the big flip in 2006. Yes. Huge for Democrats. Yes. So it just got bigger with the campaigns that have come to town and everything keeps getting bigger. What does this mean for Dallas County specifically and for the Texas Democratic Party in general in the long run? Once you get past who the nominee is, what does all this increased activity mean for Texas Democrats? Well, if, if, if I had to write a fairy tale about how we bring Texas <laughs> Democrats back, it would be to have two historic candidates who are great on the issues, excellent debaters, great communicators, have a lot of, of, of following and, and, and sort of um, appeal, and I would have them split delegate counts and I'd have them come to Texas. This is the best that any Texas Democrat could hope for. And I gotta be honest with you, and I'm partial to Barack Obama, if Barack Obama is the nominee and, and Rick Noriega is the nominee for Senate, we absolutely change the political map in Texas for years to come. Not only will we improve on our gains in Dallas County, not only will we turn Harris County blue, we're going to take back the House of Representatives this election cycle. I think that Barack Obama reaches across so many lines. He reaches across racial and ethnic lines. He reaches across uh, religious lines. Reaches across socioeconomic lines, partisan lines. I, I, I got calls from three Republicans this week asking when the Barack Obama fundraiser was going to be in Dallas so that they can contribute. And I'm so happy to say that as a Democrat, he didn't need any more money, <laughs> and, he, and to save their their checks for the fall, um, it was a nice thing to be able, a nice luxury to have. I, I got to be honest with you, I, we're going to have a robust. Uh, universe of, of Democratic primary voters that we have not had in decades. We're going to be able to bring those people back to the polls as a party. And all of the historic numbers, when people say it's a 60% Republican district or a 65% Republican district, just as those numbers were skewed by George W. Bush in 2000 and 2004 for Texas, they're going to be completely obliterated and skewed in the other direction with Barack Obama on the top of the table. So what, what are you saying? Are you saying that there's a chance Texas could flip in the, in the general? I think a Barack Obama candidacy makes a Rick Noriega Senate uh, election very, very attractive and very viable.